Hello dear traders, I'm Anna Kasatkina back with another release of financial news from InstaForex. After several weeks of desperate resistance, the euro finally left its comfort zone. A catalyst for the single currency weakening became the lack of the optimism among investors on the euro area's economic growth in the coming months. The economic sentiment index from ZEW lost over 10 points and came in at 48.1 points, marking a 12-month low. Germany, the largest bloc's economy, posted similar dynamic. The investor expectations index fell to 27.1 points, touching a low of late 2012. The indicator declined for a seventh month in a row since it had reached a historical high at 62 in last December. In late December, investors' optimism was growing due to the launch of winding down the quantitative easing program in the US and expectations of acceleration in other developed economies. However, these hopes turned out to be in vain. Now, seven months later, it is quite obvious that the Eurozone's recovery turned out to be very fragile. High unemployment, weak growth of domestic demand and low inflation put great pressure on the currency bloc and not only on peripheral countries. The German also saw a cooling development. Optimism of investors regarding the current economic environment had been rising in June, but in July the index disappointed experts, dropping to 61.8 points. I mean, the weak data from the TW, the economic sentiment index in Germany and the euro area, the European single currency fell sharply below the key level of 1.36. It is likely that the decline will continue and perhaps today the euro-dollar pair will test the mark of 1.3550. Janet Yellen's speech can push the euro even lower. Today, Fed's chairwoman will deliver a semi-annual report to the Senate Banking Committee. The president of the central bank is unlikely to hint at any terms of hiking interest rates, but in light of recent macroeconomic data, she may please the markets with an improvement of the economic situation assessment that of course will be a new cause for speculation. And this was daily financial news from InstaForex. Thank you and goodbye.